This is a video from Deddington Dental to explain how to whiten your teeth using our boutique whitening system. Um, you have one box of trays that custom fit to fit your mouth and some dental bleach and it's as simple as using the bleach in the trays overnight. Uh, but we've got a few tips uh, to help you get the best result you can. Um, the first box contain your trays. Um, so you've got two trays, one for the bottom jaw and one for the top jaw. And this is the expensive bit because they are custom fit to fit your mouth. Um, so this is the bit to look after because if they're looked after well, they can last for several years. Um, the second box contains your dental bleach. So in this box, you've got four tubes of tooth bleach. They're all exactly the same. Each tube will last about seven nights. So you've got four weeks worth of bleach. If your teeth are quite sensitive to hot and cold, what I normally recommend is you put a bit of sensitive toothpaste into your trays and wear that overnight for up to seven nights. This will reduce the risk of any sensitivity when you're doing your whitening. Uh, but imagine you're gonna start your whitening tonight. Ideally, you want to pick a time where you can bleach them every night in a row without having any breaks. This will give you a slightly better result. The first thing to do is brush your teeth. This time, rinse out all of the toothpaste and dab your teeth dry. Your bleach is a certain concentration and we wanna reduce the risk of any saliva and water getting into the system. The next step is to load up your trays with the bleach. So the first time you use one of these syringes, it's got a little cap on it. You can break that off and chuck that away. Your trays, you'll notice little bumps on the outside of the tray. Now, these are the bits that you wanna fill with bleach and it's a tiny little amount, about the size of, um, about two millimeters the size of a bit of rice. You don't wanna fill up the whole bit and you don't wanna link all of the bleach together. Separate individual bits of bleach in each of these teeth for the top and bottom. This will last a week, so you're gonna use about a seventh of that, so just a tiny little amount so you can see how much you're using each time. Once the trays are loaded, uh, the top and bottom tray, you wanna put them in your mouth you wanna do this last thing before bed um, because you don't wanna talk with them in and you don't wanna ideally have any water or drink any water when you've got them in because this will reduce the effectiveness of the bleach. Uh, so put them in last thing before bed, line them up in front of the mirror on your teeth and place them in with your fingers. Try not to bite them in. And you want to wear them for a minimum of six hours. If you wear them for a bit longer, it's not gonna cause any harm. It's quite normal to taste a little bit of it and sometimes you get a slight sore throat when you wake up after wearing these. In the morning, when you wake up, the first thing to do is take the trays out of your mouth. Give your teeth a good brush. Um, I always say to give the tray a brush, but use either warm or cold water. Don't use hot water because it can affect the shape of the trays. Um, after you've brushed the trays, shake the trays dry to get rid of any extra water. You do have a case here for long-term storage, but don't put them straight into the case when they're wet. So this is for long-term storage. What I would normally say is put them on a kitchen towel upside down, keep them out of the way of kids or pets um, so you don't lose them. And that way they'll be dry when you come to doing it again at night time. So you would repeat this process every night for at least 14 nights. You do have up to 28 nights you can use. Um, it depends on how white they're going and how sensitive the teeth are. Um, after you've done your initial whitening, we always say it's worthwhile maintaining the color of the whitening. So after you've done your two weeks or your four weeks of whitening, we say to top it up for one night every month. That will help to keep the color stable. If you have a holiday or event coming up and you wanna give the teeth a bit of a boost, you can do it for three or four nights just to give it a top up. If you have any issues or problems, please contact us at Deddington Dental and we can give you some tips on how to improve things. Sensitivity is very normal and a patchy appearance after a few days is very normal. This will settle down within a couple of weeks of stopping the bleaching. Good luck with your boutique whitening journey.